Hey guys, welcome to another commentary done by Divi. This time we're going to try to give you a very special replay for the Grand Finals. This is BSL Season 15, Game 2 between Bonbon bon and Doodle. And on this particular map, Gladiator, I felt like it was, a, it was better to utilize Titan Reactor in particular for its capabilities to kind of show you guys the, the terrain, because it's a little bit harder to tell in other game modes. But here, with Titan Reactor, you get a good look at the midfield that these players have to deal with. Otherwise, the uh, controls are a little bit slow and wonky, and I haven't really gotten used to them, so, so I'll try to do my best to provide commentary. But you can kind of see what the midfield look, looks like and all of the various terrain that are important features on this map. Upper right-hand corner, we have Bonbon bon starting as the green Protoss. Bottom left-hand corner, we have Doodle starting as the red Protoss. And actually, I kind of want to be able to utilize this more uh, down the line. We'll see if that ends up being possible. Pylon actually near the natural expansion for Doodle. and or, or, Yeah, for Doodle. And I think this is actually important because another feature, and I get to really show this off, is another feature of this map is that inverted ramp at the natural expansion. So being able to take and hold your natural is actually really, really vital. It looks like a gateway being placed towards the front. So Bon Bon... So Doodle opens up two gate, gets the correct scout. This is a four player map and it looks like he is going for two gate. He's gonna scout the upper left hand corner first. Unfortunately, he's at cross position so this might not pay off for him. But if he can make that happen. Oh, one, one downside of this is it's not playing the background audio I'm realizing, whatever. We'll switch back to the uh, other on uh, the upcoming maps. Maybe maybe there's also a plugin. There's a lot of plugins that are being developed for Titan Reactor. Look up Titan Reactor, they have a Discord they have uh, GitHub. It's just an amazing resource. And I hope to see it actually improve over time and be utilized in BSL and maybe even make its way up to ASL. Bonbon bon dropping that assimilator. So he's not opening up for the two gates. So it's almost a reverse as far as the openers in the previous match. Although I feel like on this map in particular, it might suit, especially with the cross map position, Bonbon bon might end up with a, uh, the superior advantage. But the fight over this ramp at the natural expansion is going to be real. It's going to be vital, be important. I do want to comment on game one. I feel like Bon Bon did a little bit of out thinky think of Doodle on that map. And I'm wondering if Doodle has something similar to combat this with. No assimilator as of yet. So it looks like Doodle is going to dedicate a lot of zealots. And here's the thing, if he can loft initial map control over that natural expansion, it is extremely difficult to break out of this base. Bonbon bon seeing the two gate at the front has to recognize that this is going to be potentially excessive zealot pressure. Forge actually being planted. So this is potentially going to be a cannon in for Doodle from the high ground. So these zealots need to respond right now. Bonbon bon not reacting. Two zealots here at the natural. A probe there as well. The zealots holding short. But Bonbon bon does need to react. He needs to push up and engage. Otherwise, slowly doodle is going to be able to cannon his way down so doodle with the lack of information just showing a little bit of action there i think that forge must have been scouted the probe got actually the scouting probe got wiped out first cannon down follow-up shield battery with the second gateway down for bonbon bon. first dragoon is out and now that dragoon is going to have to fight a misfire rate Again, going up that ramp as that cannon is just about finished. Zealots also in the mineral line, able to get some damage done. A shield battery's there, but I don't know the shield battery is going to be enough to press the, the height advantage of the cannons and that low ground inverted ramp for Bonbon. Bon. So Bonbon bon right now, shield battery is at least allowing the Zealots and Dragoons to have a superior attack force, but with the Let's see if there's going to be a second cannon shortly for Doodle. Doodle setting up camp here at the natural. And if he gets... It's going to be a balancing act for him now. As long as he drops those cannons, they are going to be able to go ahead and have that low ground fire rate. And you can see where that ramp acts as just a perfect funnel for troops as they're trying to fight their way up. And it is going to be extremely difficult to press and take that natural expansion. Which means Doodle, as long as he keeps sufficient troops here, can go ahead and grab his natural expansion and deny it to Bonbon. Bon. On top of that, if Doodle, or sorry, if Bonbon bon overcommits, 
another pylon over the wall just to make sure if reavers and shuttles make their way across that could be one option actually that might be the race here robotics facility about halfway finished range also just about finished for bonbon bon. a single reaver could interrupt a lot of this so doodle has to have some sort of follow-up plan i like the initial idea but does he have a follow-up plan because as soon as reavers end up on the field none of this matters right now it looks like doodle the current plan is just to maybe overwhelm with just pure zealot although he has gone ahead and dropped his assimilator in the main. He's got his own cybernetic score being built. Two zealots are wandering in to go ahead and get scouting information, actually splitting forces. Bonbon bon being caught a little bit off guard. They're on hold position. Doesn't look like they're going to get a probe. Just going to get the scouting information, see the robotic facility and very little else. Cannons being built along the perimeter as well. But I have to worry about Doodle's ability to... So he, he's going Observer first, interestingly enough. I think, wow, that actually surprises me. So Doodle opting for Observatory before Robotic Support Bay. Maybe he was concerned about Quick Dark Templar pressing into his natural. But right now, Doodle's plan is, is just hold Bon Bon back. Press him in. But And you do have a considerable amount of Zealot forces out here to go for a contain but with nothing in position without sufficient troops in position now the dragoons going to do their best to attack into the misfire right there holding short two additional dra dragoons marching their way across to reinforce but now the question is is like okay with range with the dragoons is that going to be sufficient to box the reaver in so an interesting gambit here from doodle overall a bit unfortunate that it's happening on this map because I really wanted to highlight some of the fights in the midfield over all of the spokes. Pylons being dropped on Bon Bon's side. Right now the probe count, about a five probe count lead for Bon Bon. Much larger Dragoon Army, tech lead for Bon Bon as well. Reaver is now out and slowly can crawl its way out towards the natural expansion and Reaver Scarab's do massive amounts of damage to zealots and groups, and the cannons do not range. And the misfire rate doesn't do anything because it's a traveling unit. Get a nice view of it here. And you can see the zealots just eating a lot of that fire. Ugh. The cannon's gone, so I don't. So Doodle had an interesting idea to start, but it doesn't look like he has a follow up thought aside from just hold some troops up here. But the Scarabs are happy to just walk right up that ramp. The, he needs to be very careful, though, with the Dragoon taking some pot shots. A shuttle now out to help protect that Reaver. As soon as that second Reaver's out, I don't see any way that Doodle holds this ramp. At which stage, he just needs to win a micro fight with an inferior army and inferior tech. Liking Bon Bon's shot here. Scarab... Having some trouble making its way up to the high ground. Third cannon up on the edge. At the very least, Doodle has some latent detection along that rim in case that Reaver wanted to take. That That honestly would be his best and luckiest shot is, is that if Bon Bon... Oof, eating a bit of focus fire right there. I, I think that was a miss control there on Doodle's part. Behind in supply, Bon Bon continuing to lock forward, continuing to edge... Doodle's not taking his natural expansion. Dragoon's rushing forward. Want to take that Reaver out. They do get the Reaver kill. That buys Doodle some time at the very least. Bon Bon being a little bit careless. However, there's a second Reaver out already. So now it is three Dragoons. A handful of Zealots. Sorry, not used to this control system. To try to defend this. Bon Bon pressing at the natural. He's got sufficient troops to do it. Now going to check that perimeter. He needs to be very careful along this perimeter edge with all of those cannons. Flanking Doodle, seeing the shuttle scooping up. Running, actually gets the shuttle with two zealots. One zealot able to evacuate. It felt like it should have died in the midst of that. But now Doodle has locked Bonbon bon in. Bonbon bon not feeling confident. And there's now sufficient Dragoons. Really, that was to buy time to get a sufficient Dragoon Force to pick off the Reaver and make that 
approach a little bit more challenging. So Doodle continuing to tie the noose, more pylons being dropped to provide that scouting information. But Bonbon, bon, he still has the double reaver, still might be able to press into this. He's trying to take out that pylon with the misfire right, rate along that edge. Doodle, still 10 supply down, but again, he can make up by using that high ground misfire rate to his advantage. The reavers can't peel too far forward. Otherwise, they take shots. Every Dragoon counts, though, for Doodle. Another cannon being warped in along that edge. Doodle needs to make sure that he maintains a sufficient Dragoon count where he can threaten those Reavers as they come up the ramp. Backup pylon being dropped at the natural. The Reavers positioning forward. Doodle not quite in a position to engage. The Zealot marching forward. Another slew of shots. Shuttle getting wiped out, but that costs a lot of Dragoons. So now only five Dragoons left to help defend over that edge. No third, so there's, there's a third and fourth gateway for Bonbon. Bon. Go ahead and take a look at the other side of the map. We do have a robotics facility up building a shuttle. The natural, there's a probe in position maybe to grab the natural, but as that happens, Bonbon storming up, Zealots first. The Reavers blockading the follow-up troops. It looks actually this might be a hold position of the Dragoons on the low ground, but a cannon has been wiped out. The Dragoons backing up and Bon Bon starting to breach. Zealots quickly able to wipe out that cannon. The rest of the Dragoons flooding forward. Those Reavers need to be careful that they don't get trapped and pinned back. One Reaver down. Second Reaver potentially exposed, but only four Dragoons remaining. Three Dragoons after that Reaver shot. And now Bon Bon breaking forward. Doodle trying to reinforce, but it is not going to be sufficient. Bon Bon with a huge supply lead and in a great position to take game two. And yeah, with his attack forces, he can ignore a lot. Okay, finally, going to be able to switch camera view. Do a little bit of this action. Feels a little bit anticlimactic, unfortunately. But it's going to be a cleanup operation from here. Bonbon bon going ahead and settling his natural expansion and on top of that streaming attack forces. This is where I was hoping there'd be some engagements. Zelt leg speed. Looks like it's online. Siddle of a Dune was there in the background, but Bonbon bon able to press forward and now Doodle going to have to defend his natural expansion. You can see the Dragoons trembling and hovering over that natural. There is a shuttle here, but no Reaver as of yet, Reaver, first Reaver might just finish. Bon Bon has an opportunity to attack. Zealots on top of the Dragoons. Observer in position just in case there were Dark Templar as well. A Reaver scooting up. But unfortunately not getting really good solid shots on groupings of troops. Pylon taken down in the middle. That's going to allow Bon Bon to filter his troops through. Not quite able to get on top of that Reaver. Only two, three Dragoons remaining, though. Probes pulling off the line to try to defend. Reaver still standing. Finally, Bon Bon using some micro to go ahead and engage the shuttles down. The Reaver has a Zealot on top of it. And it looks like it's going to get taken out. So it's now just probes left. And I think that might be all the probes. So this is going to be some hurt mining time. A pylon blockade behind this. So Doodle not dead, but he's at half the supply of Bon Bon. Bon Bon has his natural expansion up. A shuttle with two Reavers in it. And honestly, not a lot of counter troops to deal with this. He's got a lot of territory to defend. And not a lot of troops to defend it with. Finally returning to start mining. <clears throat> but after a very unusual opener. Go ahead and switch view just for the hell of it. Reaver taking some shots. Oh, they go fuzzy when they go over that edge. It's kind of fun. Reaver taking some free shots. This is disrupting a lot of mining here. And honestly, with just the troops that are in this Reaver alone, with this shuttle, they can wipe out the defense force. And I believe with the stoppage in play here, that was GG. Might try to use Titan Reactor forward, but currently I'm not entirely uh, acclimated to its interface. It's still a fun tool. Hope you guys go out and uh, check it out. And I want to be able to use it in the future. But in the meantime, game two goes to Bon Bon as well. And Doodle off to a rough start. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for listening.